Hello, friends. Thank you for joining me for another bonus episode in the series in which I'm sharing our family's experiences in the last year of our daughter Hannah's life, which spanned from February 2008 through February 2009. My desire is to process through the events of those 12 months with a perspective that 16 years has brought and to point people to hope in Jesus along the way. I'm grateful you've joined me. This is bonus episode number 70, Speed Bump, April 24th, 2008. At this point in Hannah's treatment, we could not have foreseen how much of a battle she would have maintaining her platelet levels. Low platelets caused ongoing issues for her the entire year she was sick. But at the time, we had no reason to believe this was anything other than a little speed bump that would quickly be resolved. Here's my email from this date, 16 years ago today. Hannah had another blood draw today to check her platelet level. Our favorite nurse was not there, so she had to be stuck twice, and they were still not able to get a vein. They finally did a finger prick and got just enough blood drop by drop to get a platelet count. We were a little bit disappointed to find out that her counts had actually dropped slightly since last Monday. It took so long to get Hannah's blood that we were late to her radiation appointment by the time they got the results back, so we basically had to run out the door as soon as we heard them and did not have an opportunity to talk to the doctor. Apparently, the doctor was not overly concerned by the drop since she let us leave and did not feel it was necessary to come out and talk to us. We will go back on Monday for our regular weekly appointment. In the meantime, Hannah is off her chemotherapy drug, which I think she is enjoying. We are so thankful for several things. Hannah has felt better today than she has all week. Very little nausea this morning. She made it through both days of her geometry exam and feels that she did well. Tomorrow will be her last radiation treatment at 6.30 a.m. She's been able to remain in school throughout her treatments. Although her hair is thinned a great deal, she still has her hair. God has provided His peace to Hannah and to all of our family throughout the last two months. We are thankful for all the friends, family, and even strangers who have been lifting us up in prayer. And finally, we are thankful that God is good all the time. Jill and Brad